Kelly, are you okay? Guys, honestly, this sucks. Like, I was perfectly fine all morning. I was feeling a lot better. I took the medication that the doctor uh, recommended yesterday, and I haven't took it today. I actually just took it. But I literally just started feeling like my shoulders and my neck tensing up. And I just felt like, oh my God, I need to lay down because it caused me to feel a little dizzy and off balance. All right guys, so as y'all know, I've been dealing with anxiety and I was doing some research and it just so happened. Some of the things that I have been eating and intaking in my meals that it can very much provoke anxiety attacks or like make my anxiety increase. And a lot of this stuff has it, you guys. And it is MSG, basically. The long word for it is monosodium glutamate. So I checked this, I checked my little uh, spice cabinet and my main ingredient to a lot of my meals has it. So I'm gonna have to throw this away this as well i was trying to snack on something and this has it as well and then lucky's little pork rinds have it um hot fries all that good stuff has it so i'm gonna have to cut that out of my diet because i'm trying to do everything that i can to help myself get better and feel better um and i have to go through like my whole entire fridge that oh, way throw it away this stuff it's not good for you well, this is the secret ingredient right here. I know, babe, but it's not good for me. Or you. Or the kids. I throw it away. Huh? Did you really just throw it right away? And what are we going to eat? Baby, I went to Kroger's yesterday. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, no. Nah, we're not going to throw away my biscuits. Okay. And I bought cinnamon rolls. No, it doesn't have a mystery in it. Wait, what am I looking for? Oh, monosodium or something. Glutamate. No, it doesn't have it. We're good on that. But All right, stop emptying out my refrigerator. Just can we see for espresso? So we're going to get some fruits and vegetables. And healthy snacks. Health is wealth. everybody we pack right now we currently waiting on the girls school bus to pull up so we can oh there it goes right there just pulled up you watching Lou Chad on TV this is the realest unfiltered dose of entertainment you're gonna see all week if you are new to this channel my name is Kelly Jean and I'm lucky Lou lucky Lucifer <laughs> oh my god que voy a hacer contigo what am I gonna do with him you guys every day is something new Say like, what's up with it though, man. Uh, Kelly was having an extreme anxiety attack yesterday. I mean, yeah. Kelly Jean got some new glasses. Check her out. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I love my new glasses, you guys. But before we get the video going, make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up and don't be a hater on your life. Make sure you subscribe right now. We currently outside our house waiting for the girls to get up off this school bus. Their school bus just pulled up and we're waiting for them to get off so we can run to the grocery store and get a couple of healthy things what's up everybody y'all miss us so we went inside of sprouts stayed under the budget got a lot of healthy stuff i did end up having one of those little episodes once again inside of the store it's very irritating you guys i don't think that's i don't think that's uh Acid reflex. Yeah, acid reflex. I don't think that's acid reflex. Because I literally took my medication. Yeah, and we didn't eat nothing today that would give me acid reflex. We are going to try eating healthier, keep on going with my medication for two weeks, see what it does. We're going to get home and then we're going to unload and get to cooking because I am hungry. 
You know why, Dad? You know why? <laughs> because this is disgusting. So I'm putting sweetness. I'm, as, I'm over here asking Kingston, why is he pouring caramel into this pumpkin spice latte? Watch. Why? I didn't put a lot, but you can't really hear it because it's like, Now, because it, it was all the way like. Boy, you better drink that. Or did she really put biscuits in the oven? Yes. Why? I'm about to make pork chops. You guys, so I got some new glasses today. Story time. <laughs> it's going to be a little quick short story. So I've always worn glasses, right? And I haven't had my glasses for about, what, like a year and a half? So my last pair of glasses, you want to tell them what happened to them? What happened to them? <laughs> Licky had got mad at me one time and he threw my freaking glasses <laughs> away. Like, who does that? <laughs> and so I wore like a whole... <laughs> you know... <laughs> <laughs> that's, God. that's God. I'm going to tell you what happened. Because you was about to lie. No! <laughs> I'm going to tell you what happened. We were mad. We were fighting. You were mad. I forgot what we were fighting about, but we was mad at each other. I wasn't mad. You were mad. I was mad that you were mad. I was so mad that you were mad. <coughs> but she was real mad. <clears throat> and when I went to the restroom, <laughs> her glasses was in on top of the toilet in the restroom. And uh, were. they were in the restroom. Yeah, they was. They were in the restroom, and then there was a trash can right next to them. So I just grabbed them and I threw them in the trash can. You know, <laughs> you... Fucked them glasses. And so look, listen, this is what happened. So I went like six months without my glasses, and then I finally went to the eye doctor and got my prescription. <laughs> and then this is last year in October, and so right before my prescription uh, was about to expire, I was like, I need to look at my glasses. So I finally went to go get my glasses, you guys, and they're super cute. Look. Ah. And Houston keeps trying to grab them. Move! You want Papa? Do you want Papa? No, she stopped. Do <laughs> you want Papa? You better stop, boy. <laughs> Anyways, long story short, I finally got my glasses. Look. Take a look at them. It's like gold right here, gold accents, but they're like clear frames, which are pretty dope. And they were only $83. Take a look at that. Look at Houston biting my toe. Stop, boy. Um, I just wanted to come and thank everybody that's been commenting and giving me feedback and just letting me know that I'm not the only one going through this. So shout out to y'all. Thank you so much. I want to encourage everybody to as well love on yourself. Take care of yourself mentally, spiritually, and physically <clears throat> because it is a huge part of why I feel like I might be dealing with anxiety. So um, What are y'all doing over here? Hey, I was getting like emotional. <laughs> you guys, it's actually clowning me because I saw some girl do this in like her her <coughs> her boyfriend's video. <laughs> Babe, stop it. <laughs> Anyways, um, what are you talking about over here? Anyway, I was just giving people. Um, I was appreciating everybody that commented. Yeah, I can't do it with you and the baby in here. I think you need to drink some ayahuasca. Can you like not put this in the vlog? Huh? Please, let's just go cook. What? Pork chops and biscuits. How about some beans? How about some of them beans? Nah, remember we were supposed to eat healthy, right? That's why they talked me into going to the grocery store to go buy some more healthy stuff, vegetables and fruit and stuff. And this is what we're eating. Pork chop pig steaks. Pork chop steaks with beans. And with biscuits. a whole bunch of Tony seasoning on there. Let's see if this contains. What oh, did you man. say? I didn't even check. No, it doesn't. Hey. Alright. So you still to the good, Tony. Biscuits, beans, and pork chop steaks. I would I would make gravy, but I don't know how to make white gravy and I don't have a little pack. No, I don't like white gravy. I like I like I like brown gravy. With your biscuits? 
I yeah. feel like them steaks would have been good on the grill. What steaks? These. Yeah, well, too late. But why are we eating pork chop steaks if we're supposed to be eating healthy, though? That's the question. Because I had already defrosted it, and the kids were complaining they were hungry, and I felt bad just going on telling them to fend for themselves. No, you tell them to eat an apple, an orange, a banana, orange. make a salad. What is he doing over here with these chips on the couch? <laughs> Say, bro. No, 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 no. He just literally threw them on the floor. Okay, let me tell y'all something, uh, viewers. This morning, okay, if y'all watched yesterday, yesterday I went to Kroger. I bought groceries. I bought snacks. I bought honey buns. I bought apple pies, the little Mrs. Baird uh, pies, the little, you know, the little, you know, them little pies, honey buns, chips, all kind of snacks that you put up in the pantry. This morning, we got up and there was ants all up in my pantry. We had to throw all that stuff away that I just bought. Because these kids be eating and leaving food on the floor and here come some ants. I was about to say that's why I don't like, boys, come here. I had to come take over. And so I put this magic touch. I learned this from watching the cook at Waffle House do his pork chops. And this is how they do it. They Press these old, press these things down like this here. And then they flip them boys over. Excuse you just throwing that greasy utensil on my counter. Clean ladies coming tomorrow, baby. They're gonna have you right. Tomorrow you ain't gotta do nothing but relax all day, baby. Tomorrow's your day. You ain't gonna cook, you ain't gonna clean, you ain't gonna do nothing. Just chill. Well, you gotta watch you for Get used to this bottle in the morning because I'd be asleep. But other than that. I gotta get the girls ready for school. Other than that, just relax, kick your feet up, and. All right, remember that whenever you're hungry. No, I, I, tomorrow I'm gonna make me a salad. That's why I bought stuff to make salads. I got my fruits, my fruits and vegetables. I'm gonna show you how to be healthy. Daddy, that's my you gotta quit eating this junk right here. What are those? Hey, 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 get up off my feet, man. I'm trying to make you healthy. You over here eating this pork. You know, this is swine. You're not supposed to eat swine. I only want like half of one of those. All right, they ready. Welcome back to America's number one family. Hold on, do it again. Welcome back to the modern day Brady Bunch. America's number one family. I want to know. The Simpsons ain't got nothing on us. How come you got two biscuits? Because I'm Big Daddy. You going to break bread? Uh-oh. Don't start choking, buddy. <coughs> he's not choking. He's coughing. It's because them beans are too spicy for him. Well, he's crying for him. Tomorrow we're gonna continue on our health tips. So uh, y'all stay tuned for that. When I'm done give, eating this pork chop, I'm gonna give my daily uh, dose of wisdom and my birthday shout outs. So y'all stay tuned. Goodbye. You feel about today. <laughs> so this is what my plate is looking like. Steaming hot. I need butter for my biscuit and then a drink and that'll be it. Look at that. I'm not done with the hair, but yeah, bro. I got two pencils. It looks like his head on fire. No, bro. It's Goku. Before we get on up out of here, we want to give a birthday shout out to Jesus Martinez turning 33 years old from that West Belford. Already, man. Never love. Appreciate y'all for watching. Stay down. We will be back. I school the young and tell them learn from my mistakes. Focus, mind a solid grind, and some nuts is all it takes. I'ma wake up and go get it, drive a farm, cause I wanna. If I could do it, you could too, cause I was born up in the gutter. He was born